broken like the first morning. Blackbird has spoken like the first bird. Praise for the singing, praise for the morning, praise for them springing fresh from the word. Sweet the rain's new fall, sunlit from heaven, like the first dewfall on the first grass. Praise for the sweetness of the wet garden, Sprang in completeness where his feet pass. Mine is the sunlight, mine is the morning, Born of the one light Eden saw play. Praise with elation, praise every morning, God's recreation of the new day. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful song. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Know that the Lord is God. He made us his we are. His people, the flock he tends. We are his people, 
the sheep of his flock. The Lord is good, his kindness endures forever, and his faithfulness to all generations. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Then Jesus went about all the cities and villages, teaching in their synagogues, and proclaiming the good news of the kingdom, and curing every disease and every sickness. When he saw the crowds, he had compassion for them, because they were harassed and helpless, like sheep without a shepherd. Then he said to his disciples, The harvest is plentiful, but the labourers are few. Therefore ask the Lord of the harvest to send out labourers into his harvest. Then Jesus summoned his twelve disciples and gave them authority over unclean spirits to cast them out and to cure every disease and every sickness. These are the names of the twelve apostles. First, Simon, also known as Peter, and his brother, Andrew. James, son of Zebedee, and his brother, John. Philip and Bartholomew. Thomas and Matthew, the tax collector. James, son of Alphaeus and Thaddeus. Simon, the Cananean and Judas Iscariot, the one who betrayed him. These twelve Jesus sent out with the following instructions. Go nowhere among the Gentiles, and enter no town of the Samaritans, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. As you go, proclaim the good news the kingdom of heaven has come near. Cure the sick, raise the dead, cleanse the lepers, cast out demons. You received without payment, give without payment.
God of new beginnings. You long for us to live in love and justice with our neighbours, with friends and strangers, with people everywhere. You call us to be just and loving in our working, in our shopping, in our caring and through our prayers. Jesus, you were a storyteller. You talked about money, wages and taxes. You told stories about integrity and forgiveness. You helped people who were in trouble. You listened to people who were sad. You call us to live as you did, to listen to each other, to be forgiving, and to love our neighbours as we love ourselves. Holy Spirit, we are discovering what you ask of us. You are wild and wise, and you speak the truth. You challenge and comfort us. You breathe life into us. You shout in the streets and whisper in our ears. You remind us what Jesus taught and practised. You take us to task. You tell us to turn around. You call us to walk in love's way. Holy Trinity, God's love in community. Every day, in all our living, help us to say yes to you. Amen. And now, as our Lord Jesus Christ has taught us, so we pray together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and for ever. Amen. O Lord, our Heavenly Father, almighty and everlasting God, who hast safely brought us to the beginning of this day, Defend us in the same with thy mighty power, and grant that this day we fall into no sin, neither run into any kind of danger, but that all our doings may be ordered by thy governance, to do always that is righteous in thy sight. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you and with all the peoples of the world today and forevermore. Amen.
Would you stop? 